Hello, beautiful people of the internet. My name is Ryan, and welcome back to our Skyrim blind playthrough. It's episode 257, and we're in the Dragon, the Dawn Guard DLC. I keep calling it the Dragon Board. The Dawn Guard DLC, and uh, specifically, we just uh, finished attracting some moths, you know, at, uh, at uh, the Ancestral Glade, reading the Elder Scrolls, losing our goddamn minds. And we have a new quest, which tells me to go to Oriel's Bow, which is in Darkfall Cave. So I think, yeah, let's go. I think the way, uh, I think the way that this worked actually was that reading, I couldn't exactly tell, but yeah, I think so. So I think this river is was on the map and these mountains were on like the elder scrolls reading them together actually drew a literal map and then it gave me the location so we're gonna go there um to it's by druidak readout readout of course it is um to find the bow i don't know exactly what the bow is gonna do but we're gonna find it so that's the goal for this episode um yeah me and serana on the road again me and my dead soul horse and Serana and all our friends. My dead soul horse and my immortal follower and all my friends. I can't wait to be on the road again. So, uh, let us fast travel. Let us proceedeth to fast traveleth all the way over. Nope. Nope. All the way over to more Kazgar. If I remember right, this was the like... Yeah, this place was like an orc place, right? Maybe? I don't know. That's unimportant. Uh, we need to go specifically to the southwest to Darkfall Cave. Okay. Southwest. Let's grab Aardvark and uh throw go that way yo i should say really quickly while i have my quest markers open people been giving me shit about my uh the amount of quests i have open uh hey back off it's my it's my quest log i can do with it what i want you turds yes it is true that i have one two three four five six seven eight nine current quests open but listen, I use those as markers for what quests I'm interested in. Uh, for instance, these are just the quests that I believe that we will do. Or that I am at least interested in doing. I should probably take the numbers job off. Honestly, I think we're probably about at the end of the numbers jobs, even though I am the ledger bane. I don't know. We'll maybe do one more. I am the ledger bane, but we'll see. Um, Cursed Tribe was interesting to me. It was a quest unlike any other I'd seen. Pale Lady was interesting. Discerning the Transmundane. We got to go back to Septimus Ligma Amogus here in a second. When, once we're back on the main storyline. Uh, unfathomable, unfathomable, be unfathomable deaths. Oh my God. Never mind. All right, sweet. We're just going, we're just going forward. I can't even read that out loud. Unfathomable depths. Yikes. Anyways, I don't come into your house and make fun of your quest markers, but you also don't post YouTube videos of your quest markers on the internet, so I guess all's fair. Uh, all's fair. All's fair. Love and war. So, I wonder what we will find here. Do you think Harkin has also found this place? My instincts tell me yes. Darkfall Cave. Uh, let's see if Serana actually, before we go in, let's see if Serana has anything to say about the fact that we were attacked. Yes. Nope. That we were attacked by a gargoyle at the last place and vampire masters. She does not. So, let's just send it. Just gonna send it. Darkfall Cave, Oriel's Bow. Oh, it is dark. I don't necessarily want to cast this and give away my location, but it is going to be much easier for you guys to see if I do that. Hmm. Okay. We have... 
sort of labyrinthine little place. With some water. I gotta get in the water, right? Tripod spiderfish. They're just sitting dead still. Sort of terrifying. They're just sitting dead still, not moving at all. <laughs> what is this? Subnautica? Uh, Alright, let's get out of here. I thought maybe there'd be like a buried chest or something. Why won't it let me sprint? Oh, I was crouched. <sighs> it's been a long day. Sorry. <laughs> oh, there's a spider. Fuck this spider. Okay, there we go. Dead spider. It's not even been all that long of a day. <laughs> it's like the afternoon right now. It's fine. Uh, it's totally fine. It's not even been nearly that long enough of a day. It's just winter time, man. I'm one of those people who gets truly affected by seasonal affective disorder, and uh, we are in the meat of it right now. Did you hear something? Oh, it's very dark out here, too. Did I hear something? Could it be the water f freaking flowing below us? Oh my god, we gotta go down there, don't we? Oh no. This is gonna be shitty. Look at this broken thing. Oh yeah. Oh, we definitely have to go down. Oh no. There's only one place to go and it's down. Oh no. Oh, I don't want to do it. But I will. Right? It's the only way to go. Let's cast this. Uh. Yeet! Oh, Jesus Christ, it broke. I don't know that I've ever- I don't know that I ever rode this ride at, uh, at Disney World. Oh. Oh! No! Uh-uh. What? Oh! God! Ah! Oh man, I was not aware if I died or you died. Or, or it died there. Are there more? There are definitely more. Oh, that's Serana's. I'm dumb. Alright. <laughs> okay, alright. We got some glowy shit. Glowing mushrooms. Oh, more, more spideys. Of course, because it isn't enough to just fight vampires, is it? Of course, I also got to fight the... Oh, are you still fighting? Your Serana's, I think. Ooh! Alright. I wonder if they have a more powerful spell than Candlelight. You know? I like Candlelight. Um, imagine if they have one that's like Torchlight or like Bonfire. It's a bonfire. Turn the lights out. Mmm, that's a spider. Who's there? Oh, wait. Fuck you. Nobody... Nobody spits on me. Other than... The people that I let spit on me. Nobody spits on me other than the people I... I, I don't know how to answer... That. I don't know how to end that. I don't know how to end that joke. Uh, we're just gonna move on. We're gonna move on. We're gonna move right past that one. Nobody noticed anything. I didn't say anything. Okay. Alright. God, why is it so dark? Oh, heebie-jeebies. I got the heebie-jeebies. Even with candlelight. There's something right up there. Is that gonna close behind us? 100%. These people were... Why would anyone want to set up camp here? It's a great question. Cure poison? Lots of glowing mushrooms. What happened to them? Oh shit, this person's dead. Darkfall Cave No. Oh wow! 
Uh, sister, I know that you'll come find me. I will be too late. If you find this letter, get out of this forsaken cave as soon as possible. We were fools to think we could live so close to such creatures and live peacefully. Do they mean spiders or do they mean vi vampires? I should have headed back to camp with you after we placed the torches down here. I thought these trolls would be different. That they would somehow understand that we didn't want to hurt them. I'm now cornered and it's only a matter of time before one of the internet trolls decides to finish me off. No! I hope it's a quick death. Oh no! Farewell, dear sister. Oh, shit. Let me add him. I should have brought an armored troll. How, how do I keep forgetting to bring armored trolls with me? Coin purse. Cure poison. Spider egg. Potion of minor healing. Nothing here. Oh, my God. That spider scared the fuck out of me. All right. Um, Let's go up first. I can't really tell. She says torches, but there's... Torches both ways. Let's go up. How bad how bad could these trolls be? They're different than other trolls? Sure. I've I've met my fair share of bad trolls before though, you know? Hey look, it's almost almost daylight. I am hearing some pretty funky noises. Noises I don't like. That's the technical term. Fucky noises. I heard one big groaning noise that I was not a fan of. God, this is a vibe, this place. Ah! This is how we leave? Maybe? Yeah! This is where we, uh, where we killed the guys already. Alright, cool. Well, let's go back down. Great. Now we know. Alright. Pop off our candlelight. Now we go down. Oriel's bow is somewhere in here, huh? Oh. Little tripwire action. Oh, shit. <laughs> I looked the wrong way. Little tripwire action. All right, all right. This candlelight is really not stretching nearly far enough. I want to be able to see that wall right there. Okay, okay, all right. So just step around them. Step around the boulder. Step around the boulder. Okay, all right. All right, all right, I'm a little scared. Okay, just continue making noises so that you won't hear the sound of something creepy. As I'm filming this... <laughs> As I'm filming this, I'm going to be playing the uh, noted horror game Outlast tomorrow on stream because uh, my Twitch chat hates me. And <laughs> oh, I'm not good at horror games at all. And I have agreed to play exactly one hour of Outlast and I just kind of already hate my life. I downloaded it and I watched the, uh, I watched the Steam trailer. We should quick save. And uh, I'm, oh, I'm already fucking scared. Uh, let's use our normal bow for a shot here. Normal bow. Sneak attack. No more sneak attack. Oh, that one's jumping. Sneak attack. Yeah. Yeah. One more. Dead. I hope that's all of them. I don't know what I'm doing with my life, considering between Subnautica, this freaking place right now in Skyrim, and Outlast. I feel like I've I spent so many years being like, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to play scary games. And uh, somehow, somehow, I feel like I've been fucking tricked into, into going there. Bloody rags? Oh, I don't like that. Okay, that's the dead sister, I think, probably. Or a member of the dead sister's party. Um. Hmm. I bet we gotta go that way. What do you think? What do you think, Serrano? What do you think? 
Oh, yep, right there. What is that? And what are you doing? Oi. Quick save. Hold the fucking phone. What's that? What the fuck? Come forward. You have nothing to fear here. I'm actually gonna wait until my candlelight runs out if I can. This is a, this is a weird thing to say. I'm gonna wait until my candlelight runs out because it's actually too bright now, and I want to see this guy's face. What in the hell is happening here? Also, that does look like a sun, but I don't see a bow. Did it say Paladin Gelibor? Candlelight, come on. Go away. It'll go away before too long, I think, at this point. Knight Paladin Gelibor. I am Knight Paladin Gelibor. <laughs> Welcome to the Great Chantry of Oriel. The Great Chantry. This cave is a temple to Oriel. Oh, you have a you have a like very distinctive pretty face, actually. Oriel, Oriel, Halkosh, Akatosh. So many different names for the sovereign of the snow elves. What? Snow Elves? I prefer Snow Elf. The name Falmer usually holds a negative meaning to most travelers. What? Those twisted creatures you call Falmer, I call the Betrayed. I imagine you know why we're here? Of course. You're here for Oriel's bow. Why else would you be here? I can help you get it. But first, I must have your assistance. What type of assistance do you need? So first off, uh, how did you know? Falmer, there's Snow Elf, and then there's the Betrayed Snow Elves? Snow Elves? For the thousands of years I've served as the Chantry's Center, thousands? there hasn't been a single visitor here for any other reason. They request Oriel's bow, and I request their assistance. It's been repeated so many times, I can't imagine it any other way. What type of assistance? Have they all failed before me? I need you to kill Archcurate Vertha. My brother. Archcurate Verther. Those are a couple words I don't know. Curate and then Verther. The kinship between us is gone. I don't understand what he's become, but he's no longer the brother I once knew. What? Since the betrayed. They did something to him. I just don't know why Oriel would allow this to happen. What did the betrayed do? They swept into the Chantry without warning and began killing everyone without pause. Didn't you fight back? The Chantry was a place of peaceful worship. I led a small group of paladins, but we were no match for the Betrayed's sheer numbers. They slaughtered everyone and stormed the inner sanctum where I believe they corrupted Vertha. Corrupted? You don't even know if he's alive? Wait, so when you're saying this, do you mean it's like out back here or something? Like through this doorway? Is this a doorway right here? You don't even know if he's alive? He's alive. I've seen him, but something's wrong. He never looks as though he's in pain or under duress. He just stands there and watches, as though waiting. What is happening? Have you tried getting into the inner sanctum? Leaving the Way Shrines unguarded would be violating my sacred duty as a Knight Paladin of Oriel. And an assault on the Betrayed guarding the inner sanctum would only end with my death. Way shrine? What's that word mean? Yes. Let me show you. So oh, okay. This structure is known as a way shrine. They were used for meditation and for transport when the Chantry was a place of enlightenment. Prelates of these shrines this is incredible. with teaching the mantras of Oriel to our initiates. What's that basin in the center signify? Once the initiate completed his mantras, he'd dip a ceremonial ewer in the basin at the way shrine center and proceed to the next way shrine. So these initiates had to lug around a heavy pitcher of water. <laughs> Marvelous. How long would they have to do that? Well, once the initiate's enlightenment was complete, 
he'd bring the Ewer to the Chantry's inner sanctum. Pouring the contents of the Ewer into the sacred basin of the sanctum would allow him to enter for an audience with the Arch Curate himself. All that just to end up dumping it out? It makes no sense to me. It's symbolic. Yeah. I don't expect you to understand. So, let's get this straight. We need to do all the what the fuck? To Incredible. To temples so we can kill your brother and claim Ariel's bow. I know how it all sounds. But if there was another way, I'd have done it long ago. The only way to get to my brother is by following in the initiate's footsteps and traveling from Way Shrine to Way Shrine, just as they did. The first lay at the end of Darkfall Passage, a cavern that represents the absence of enlightenment. Hmm. How many Way Shrines? I have a lot, I'm gonna I have a, I'm gonna say a couple things before we go on here. Uh, in no way, shape, or form. Once again, Skyrim has such a good tendency to do this, which is like, this is in no way, shape, or form what I would have expected. But within two minutes of of walking into something completely brand new, including the fact that Falmer are snow elves, right? Except there's also snow elves that are not Falmer, uh, and in their own ways miraculous. It sounds like. Within two minutes of that new news, I'm just like, yeah, this is a world that makes sense. Yeah, of course it makes sense that the Snow Elves, or at least this one, is like a member of like this religious monastic order. Uh, yeah, of course, sure. How many way shrines are there? There are five in total, spread far apart across the Chantry. Caves must be massive. Caves? Oh no. The Chantry encompasses far more than a few caves, as you'll soon discover. But before I send you on your way, you'll need the initial yeah. sewer. Need to fill this at each way shrine? Once you've located a way shrine, there'll be a spectral prelate tending to it. Spectral. They will allow you to draw the waters from the shrine's basin as if you've been enlightened. I'll be off then. This may be the last time we're able I mean, to converse. Yeah. If you have any questions before you leave, a million questions. I suggest you ask them. A fucking million Otherwise, questions, buddy. What I can do now is grant you my hopes for a safe journey. Can you give me a straight up multi-volume history of the Snow Elves and the Betrayed? Questions? I yeah. expected as much. Give me two seconds first off. Um <laughs> We've not dis we've not <laughs> this is <laughs> The other thing that's insane here is that we've never encountered a knight or a paladin in Skyrim in the 200 as far as I know and I think I would remember as far in the in the 255 episodes was 56 episodes before this one we've all oh man oh man I can't wait to look at this initiates Ewer. uh you were so let's take a look at it uh miscellaneous under I probably yeah very cool very cool all right uh questions for you yeah who were your people we were once a wealthy and prosperous society also you've lived for a thousand years Skyrim or something unfortunately we were constantly at war with the Nords who claimed the land as their ancestral home it appears the Nords won in a manner of speaking <laughs> we had always maintained an uneasy alliance with the underground dwelling dwarves, and when faced with extinction, we turned to them for help. Surprisingly, they agreed to protect us, but demanded a terrible price. The blinding of our race. It's not possible that everyone agreed to that? There were splinter groups that resisted the agreement, and even some that sought alternate alliances. But when it was all said and done, those elves were either slaughtered, vanished, or gave up and took the dwarves' bargain. What turned your people into the betrayed? I've often asked myself that very same question. The blinding of my race was supposedly accomplished with a toxin. The so uncomplicated Dwemer, by the way. Them into the sad and twisted beings they've become. Okay. Why weren't the snow elves here affected? The Chantry is quite isolated. So it took some time for word of the Dwarves' offer to reach us here. By the time the compact had been completed, it was too late for us to even attempt to intervene. Is that why you've retained your sight? Correct. We only numbered perhaps a hundred at the time, 
so our presence remained a secret to the dwarves and the Nords. Ironically, our undoing came at the hands of our Incredible. own people. The betrayed. Yes. They swarmed the Chantry in vast numbers until we were completely overrun. We never really stood a chance. I assumed that the Arch Curate was corrupted by them when they found a way to... What does that mean? Corrupted? Sanctum. I'm gonna find out. I'm gonna find out. What in the fuck is this? What is this quest line? I am in... Uh, in I am... At a loss for words, but in a good way, I would say. In a, like, what have I stumbled into type of situation. There are others here like you? Bertha and myself are the only two snow elves. Two snow elves. Wow. What is the Chantry? This is, or was, yeah. the epicenter of our religion. Most of the snow elf people worshipped Oriel. The Chantry was constructed near the beginning of the first era to provide a retreat for those that wish to become enlightened. Beginning? <sighs> Sorry. I got I got a yawn there. Um... The first era, okay. Retreat for those who wish to be enlightened. Most snow elves. Our empire had temples to some of the other deities. Trinimac, Cerebane, Yefrey, and Finister rounded the rest. But those temples paled in comparison to the glory of the Chantry and its way shrines. I am so ready to go on this pilgrimage to the five different way shrines. Oh yes. They were an important part of the process here. Yeah. They represented the steps the initiates yeah. took on the path to total enlightenment. Sadly, the magic used to construct these wonders were lost long before I arrived here. I have such a sense of loss. This is a beautiful moment for me. Oh, man. I have such a sense of loss for the snow elves. And I've met one of them. And I have a, a sense of loss for, like, their, in a, like, their whole, you know, religious, uh, Undertaking here as well. Oh man, what are the spe who are the spectral p spectral prelates that you mentioned? They're ghosts of the snow elf priests that tended the way shrines before being slaughtered by the betrayed. Through the grace of Oriel, they were restored to their spectral form to enable them to continue their duties. Good, they should be able to help us. I'm afraid in their current form. They still believe the Chantry to be an active center of worship. I can't wait to find the they Arch Curate to you in any and see what the Corrupted looks like. And you're undertaking the journey to the yeah. Inner Sanctum. Okay. Oh. May Oriel keep you free from harm. May Oriel keep you free from harm. Uh, Serana. Nothing. Cool. Incredible. Oh... Okay, holy shit. Skyrim does it again, man. Out of nowhere this comes. Holy god, we're gonna take a I'm gonna take a quick look here. I wish I could find out how old he was. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. You scared me. I thought a spider was running down from that thing. Uh I mean I'm not tripping, right? He said like thousands of years. All right, it's time. Questions? I expect. No, at this point, it's just time. I think I go through. Do I go through? Yeah. Whew. Questions? I expected as much. Okay, so I have to. I have to survive Darkfall Passage. So this is not the first one. Wait, wait, wait. Hold up. Have I? Have I already dipped it in this? I don't know that I've already dipped it, right? Um, does it already have, is the idea that it already has? All right, cool. Whoo, all right. It wasn't as unpleasant as I thought it would be. Kind of soothing, actually. I feel a little warmer now. <laughs> I feel a little warmer now. <laughs> Are these soul husks? No? <gasps> Whoa! Bioluminescent, and they and they disappear when you get close. Whoa! And they reappear when you when you go away, go past. Oh my god! <gasps> Fucking! I thought Where that's what that was, you son of a bitch! 
It's my least favorite thing. Other than maybe Falmer. Done and done. Oh, it makes the worst fucking noise. We just kicked that Chorus, by the way. Worst possible noise. All right. Uh, we should, we're going to do a, a big save, by the way. We're going to do a big save. Um, <clears throat> big save, big save. Where's he coming from? Get out of here. Get out of here. You and Knight Paladin Gelbrathor, or whatever his name is, are the same. Are the same. You're the same. It's insane to me. It's insane to me. It's insane. And the Dwimmer are to blame. Can you imagine? The Dwimmer are to blame. The uncomplicated Dwimmer. All right, we got one over there. Where did he go? I was going to loot his body, but his body just disappeared. It's fine. Did Serana raise it from the dead? Oh, wait. You know what we you know what we haven't done a lot of recently? Do we still have it or did I get rid of it? Um Did I get, did I get rid of the Nightingale blade? I did. Damn. I could honestly use the uh stamina. We got rid of it and uh Oh shit, more Chorus. And now I'm low low stamina all the time. You know? That'll teach you. Yeah, fuck that. Fuck Chorus. Um Okay. Oh, you're not dead. You're you're raised. Okay, great. Love that. I don't love it. Spoiler spoiler alert. I do not love it. Dead body. All right. Are we this way? Oh, oh, I'm in the water. Oh no, give me out. Oh no. I knew I heard something. Is it up there? Dude, I got in the water. Oh no. Is there shit down here? Wait a second. What? What? <laughs> Tell me I'm in a secret place. What? Gleam Blossom? Darkfall Passage Note 1. I made it farther than I thought, but I'm afraid I can't go on. I choose not to. I'm content to die here in this quiet little room alone with my thoughts. The creatures won't follow me here. No more danger. The silence is welcoming. What the fuck? Elven arrows. What is a gleam blossom? I don't think I found one before. What is this? Huh? No, utterly, utterly unknown. Huh? Ooh, I got, I guess my subnautic is showing, right? But like, I got like, take some oxygen and then let's go down again. Is there more down here? No. They do light this passage, so it's not like that secretive, but like, it's, you got to go into the water to find it. <laughs> Holy shit. I'm proud I did. Oh, that's Serana's Charis. I'm dumb. Oh, wait. Nah. Leave me alone. Nah. Did I just get killed by Serana? What just happened? Did I attack her Charis? Ah, oh, piss. It had been so long since I'd saved. Not that long, but... Damn it. Alright, well, I guess I deserve that. I guess I deserve that. Let's fuck up some Palmer. Sorry, guys. It had been a little bit. I'm too obsessed with what's happening here. It had been a little bit. Uh, let's kill a couple y'all. And... Serana, just do me the favor of, like, not raising these people from the dead. You know? The Charis or the Falmer. I would prefer if you didn't. Is that cool with you? 
All right, a quick save. Does this one also have water in it? It does. Uh, what? So these have passages. All of them. Okay. Well, in that case, I guess I'm sort of glad. <laughs> is this the same? Wait, this is the same one. Okay. Um... Huh. All right. Was there a passageway on either side? No, it's just one side. So I guess I just jumped in a different pool than I thought I did the first time. Hmm? Who, who are we fighting? Oh, it's over here? Okay. Yeah, alright. There we go. I'll quick save so that I know that we're... Okay, I figured it out. We know where we are now. Alright, great. Quick save, and we are good. So, uh, that looks like a booby trap. No? Yeah? Activate rope release. Serana, come stand like here. Yeah. That's probably very rude of me. Um, it was funny though. You have to admit. Yeah. Nothing. Okay. So what is this little passage? What is this little passage? Oh, this is where we were. Oh, I wonder if you can use that as a trap then. Okay. Um, this cave is weirdly beautiful. Not super great. Not my favorite, but... No choruses, please. I knew I heard something. Yo, meet my crossbow. Meet my crossbow, buddy. Meet my fucking crossbow. Alright. Couple Falmer. Gonna raise him from the dead. There's at least a couple more over here. Yeah. All right. Um. He's calling the betrayed. Yeah, they must be what they were calling. What he was calling the betrayed, for sure, for sure. Um. What do you think that is? I don't know. Ooh, yikes. Oh my God, we're almost done with 40, 45 minutes. Holy shit. I would not have guessed that. All right, let's do a little bit of looting. You fucker. You fucker. I hate you so much. Beautiful. It's the worst noise. Um, prolonged invisibility. That's probably a nice clue of something that we could do to make our lives a little bit easier up here. Who's there? Yep, who is here? Who is here? She's trying to set me on fire. Shadow Master? I don't know what that is. Oh, I paralyzed her. I was like, why is she on the ground? Yeah, get fucked. Uh, okay. All right. Oh, yeah. Terrible sound. Terrible sound. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it with fire. Kill it. Is it possible to turn the volume of exactly one kind of enemy down? Because if so, I know 
what I would like to turn down, and it is the the hunter ones. Those those ones. I hate them. Ugh. All right. Let's take another Gleam Blossom. Palmer War Axe. This uh this cave here is cool. This this uh waterfall part. Something Where'd behind it. From? There's something off to the side too? Yeah, where did you come from? Okay. Whew. There's stuff over here? No. Dead end. Okay. Um Definitely some more up here. Should quick save? It's been a while. Can I hit somebody with a sneak attack, please? Keep your eyes open here. <laughs> e nope. All right. I knew I heard something. Teamwork right there. Teamwork right there. Is that Serranus? It looks like a bone man. I'm a bone man. It is Serranus skeleton. <laughs> uh, that is booby tracked. Uh, booby, booby trapped. No boobies. No boobies, please. No boobies. Dead skeleton. Oh, you know one uh, one other thing that our friend said, uh, our paladin friend said that other people had tried this before over the last thousands of years or whatever, you know? So all of these skeletons, I think, or at least some of them, some of them might be like snow elf skeletons from when the betrayed came in and fucked shit up. But I think others are meant to be uh, people who like attempted the same also needed the bow or wanted the bow and uh, came for it, you know? There's just a skeleton in the middle in the middle there. Why is there a skeleton in the middle there? Open the gate. I don't like it. I don't want to know why that's there. You know? All right, I'll bite. I'll step in the middle. There's a hand on top of its head. There's two hands on top of its head. Who's there? What in the fuck is happening in the middle of here? You know? Something. Boy. Are you trying to drop out on top of me over here, buddy? I've been poisoned? I don't like that. Oh, good jump. Can I can I paralyze you, please? Please die. Please die. Oh, okay. What? Who did it? What? <laughs> right after I'd killed him. Okay, what was that? Oh man. I knew I heard something. I guess I hadn't saved. I mean, obviously I hadn't saved. Alright, we've already done the exploring. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna go try and kill that guy again and uh, in that process Um we will Then we then we will save. Alright, we'll unlock this. Uh what's in the chest? A little bit of gold, that's it really. This is that weird skeleton that we saw earlier that Serana raised from the dead. I think what happened here is that a 
a Falmer like fell from the sky or something. Like, where'd you come from? Where does he? Oh, he comes from out of those. Okay, yeah, yeah. We should quick save. All right. Oh, he fucked me up again. I didn't heal this time. I wasn't paying attention at all to my health bar. All right. There's still hard fights in this game. Still very hard fights in this game. I'll hit you a couple times. And then I'll heal. And then I'll let Serana tank for me for a little bit. Can I paralyze? Beautiful. Paralyze is exactly what I would like. Beautiful. Incredible. He's dead. All right. Whew. Uh, let's kill this guy. Beautiful. Okay, and that is where we will leave it for this episode. Um, incredible. So we got some uh, something more to do next time. I don't even know. You know. <laughs> Sometimes at the end of an episode, I think to myself, how am I going to describe at the beginning of the next episode what we did during this episode? Well, I went to, <laughs> to a certain place to look for the mythical bow of a god of the snow elves, only to find out in that place, right after I had attacked a bunch of trolls, that a hidden religion of a race of beings that I did not exactly know existed is still alive. I met their chief paladin. He sent me on a religious monastic quest through a bunch of... I don't know. We'll figure it out for the next one. Thanks so much for watching this one. It was insane, but I loved it. Uh, we will see you tomorrow at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for more. Until then, bye bye <laughs>